주세요. 기다렸습니다. I'm secretly hoping that's Tay's voice, cause I like that, and it seems like it would suit him. So, hey guys, welcome to another episode of Nameless: The One Thing You Must Recall. Um, we had a bit of a scare with Yunho, our little precious innocent Yunho, which is now being highly questioned, <laughs> cause it's like, oh no. Okay, we know we, there's some hints of abuse, obviously, and. He needs to feel like he's being a good doll because of that abuse. But then it got really fucking creepy. Just really, really creepy. And I just, I, I, uh. And I think I'm not going to get a bad end. I think I'm going through the chapters properly. Because, uh, as I mentioned before, I am no longer using the guide. Uh... At least for now. If I get a bad ending, um, then I'll have to reload back to where I started making choices again. Um, after John's cat, or the cat named John or whatever. And, uh, or wherever I feel like I went wrong, or wherever the guide tells me I went wrong, whatever it is. And then, um, fix that in order to continue on. But until it comes to that point, then I'm gonna assume I'm fine. And I'm so, I'm a little scared, cause it did say that Yunho's route can have violence, and I'm just a little and like we already saw like a little hint of that, and I'm just I'm a little uh, I'm a little hesitant about this, <laughs> but uh, I will pursue courage and go through with the consequences, and we will start. Oh boy. Theme park. I don't remember what voice I gave this dude. Okay. Um, <laughs> you know, what should you wear today? I like you better than Alicia or Lena, you know. Now I'll, now I'll let you sit on the highest place so we can always see each other's eyes. Hmm? Why are you avoiding my eyes? Avoiding my eyes, you bad boy. Why are you refusing me? Why? I can love you forever if you stay good. Why are you betraying me again? Ha! Oh. Oh no. Uh, this is only making me more concerned. Uh. Oh. <sighs> I had a good sleep. Even though we just went through a nightmare on my end, but you know, whatever. Today's the weekend, so I slept in a bit. I still felt a bit spacey from sleeping so much. Ah, uh, today again. I saw the carrot cake at the corner of my desk. After that day, Yunho handed to headed to Banjul every day after school, and repeated coming home late with Tay after he finished work. Tay used to come early some days, but for some reason he was always late too. The cake box Yunho's holding every time he comes home. He always brought carrot cake from Banjul. At the third day, I asked Tay if something was going on, but Tay told me it was nothing. Why does Yunho wait until the cafe closes and bring back carrot cake? I asked Yunho why he goes to Banjul, but he just said because he likes to. Is he waiting for the cafe to close so he can bring the cake? I should go to Banjul when I get the chance. I have to check why Yunho heads there every day. I feel like this will lead to a bad ending. I really do. Just a little sneaking suspicion. We will see, though. He used to hang out with other girls after school, but nowadays he doesn't pay attention to them as much. Uh, today's weather is good. I saw. Today's weather is good. I saw a bird on the windowsill this morning. I at the convenience store. I'll get milk. Okay. Ah, so many today as usual. My smartphone was full of texts from Yunho, another one of Yunho's habits along with the carrot cake, reporting everything that happens in his day. Today's weather is good. I saw a bird on the window sill this morning. I'm in the convenience store, I'll get milk and other mundane daily things. I wonder if I can scroll up and see what else he could have done. Okay, no, that was just the last thing. Okay. Sometimes when I reply something like, yeah, today's weather is really good, he gets more excited and texts me more. Like a kid who just got off a tour, just, 
like a kid who just got a toy as a gift. Sometimes the texts become bothersome, but it wasn't as if they were troubling, so I let Yoon Ho do whatever he wanted to. He'll get tired of it soon and stop, I guess. Oh, Master, are you awake? I was just about to go and wake you. I slept so much I woke up by myself. It's my happiness to wake you up. I'm disappointed. I get up by myself on the weekends, but I can't get up if you don't wake me during the weekdays now, since you always wake me up. I smiled at Yoon Ho. <laughs> Yoon Ho smiled too. Oh, Master, I'll get your breakfast ready. Come to the kitchen when you're ready. Usually Tay cooks breakfast, but Yoon Ho's been taking over a lot these days. Okay, alright. Here, Master, go ahead. Yoon Ho put rabbit shaped fried eggs and toast in front of me. On one side. On one side. Where. What? Oh, on one side where butter and jam aligned neatly. I guess they accidentally added an E right there. I've been finding some interesting mistakes, and then finding ones that don't even exist because of being overtired. Along with the Texan carrot cake, I see this it I see this every morning. Still artfully done. When does Yoon Ho wake up to make all this in the morning? I'm glad I get to eat warm eggs in the morning, but isn't this too much for him to do? I told him he doesn't have to make the rabbit-shaped fried eggs anymore, but he told me it's fine since it doesn't take much time. What are you all doing today? I'm going to do the laundry. The weather's nice. Oh, I'm going to the arcade with my friends! We're picking the best player today! I smirked at what Red said. Mmm, all the young souls can go out and play. I'm going to rest here. My face is getting dry from all the exhaustion. I have to rest today if I'm to see other roses tomorrow. Yuri, if you stay here, I will ab I will obviously be unable to focus, so we'll have to go to the library. The library, a place I've never even set foot on, and I probably never will. Yeah! Considering it's supposed to be in, not on, again. The exams are coming soon, so... The exams are coming soon, so... Ugh! I groaned without knowing. The exams, they aren't imminent, but still. I feel gloomy already. Lance is really incredible. Hey, Master. Yeah? If you don't have any plans for today... Yunho spoke hesitatingly. Can you go somewhere with me? There's a place I'd like to go. Today? Yunho nodded. A place Yunho wants to go. Is it a desert... Is it a dessert cafe or something? I was about to say desert cafe. That doesn't make sense. I don't have any plans and there's no reason to say no. C can we? Besides, I can't refuse when he's asking with that cute face. Which I am now hesitant of. Compared to her. Okay, alright. Really? Yay! So where are we going? <laughs> You'll know when we get there. Yunho was so excited he barely ate. Where is he taking me? I couldn't even guess. The amusement park! Considering that's the theme of this chapter. Bus number 72, Yunho said while looking at a piece of paper that I guess told the directions. Hmm, I won't ask where we're going, but could you just tell me if that if it's far? I knew he wouldn't answer if I asked where we're going, so I asked him something he would tell me. It's a little bit far. Don't kill me, Yunho. <laughs> Don't turn into a murderous, rampaging doll and kill me. Please. Oh, but we can come back by today. Okay. Uh, okay. If we do come back. <laughs> if we do come back. I see. It's still pretty far since he mentioned we'll be back by today. Hmm. I looked at Yoon-ho, letting him know I looked forward to it. Uh, um, it's not any place weird. Huh? Weird. Um, it's not anywhere Yuri would take you. A place Yuri would take me? What are you imagining? <laughs> we can come back by today for sure. It's a place children can go. Okay, okay. I don't understand what he's saying, but let's just let it go. I bet it's the amusement park. It's totally the amusement park. <laughs> oh, Master, I thought of something since we're here to take the bus. Yeah, what is it? Why don't we take the bus like this on our way to the academy? I was surprised at the unexpected suggestion, and I looked at Yunho. I felt bad watching you almost- Oh, never mind. I felt bad watching you almost escape every time you get off the car, so you can't even get off with me. I hate that I always have to get off first. I want to be by your side all the time. There are a lot of people in the bus in the morning, but we can go to school together. I agreed with what Yunho said. 
The limo is comfortable, but it bothered me that I had to get off every time worrying about what others think. No matter how careful I am, there's no way to escape the jealous looks from the girls who see me get off the limo. Get out of the limo. Uh, getting off the bus makes sense. Out of the limo is what makes sense, not off when it comes to a limo. English, why do you have to f make foreigners so confused? Though they have been doing really well with this, I can't complain too much. It's just me nitpicking at this point. I'd feel more comfortable taking the bus, but... Right? I knew it. And if we take the bus, Master and I can go to school by ourselves. Okay, alright, you're right. It's weird for a student to take a limo anyways. But since there are a lot of people in the bus... Until the bus station is fine... Until the bus station is fine, but we'd have to go separately after we get off. I was about to tell him that when the bus came. Oh, the bus is here. That's the one, right? 72? Yes! Yunho answered enthusiastically. We got on the bus. This bus goes pretty far. Can't you just give me a tiny hint? I used my term as I asked. It's not fun if I tell you. Yunho looked very determined. He looked so cute I wanted to pinch his cheeks. Just leave this day to me. You will like it for sure. What is the place to... M what is this place to make him so excited? To be honest, seeing Yunho so excited, I thought anywhere would be fine. Oh no, I'm scared. Are we going to be in some dark alley? <laughs> We rode the bus for about 40 minutes. We got off at an unexpected place, but it was a place from my memories. The theme park. Yep, called it. Oh, this is the amusement park I went to when I was little. <laughs> Are you surprised? Isn't this the amusement park you talked about before? How did you? This is the only amusement park around here, so I thought this was the place. And the merry-go-round here looks like the one from the picture book. Oh. Yunho remembered me saying we should come here together one day. I remembered the merry-go-round in the fairy tale book. I thought Master would like to come here, so I really wanted to take you here, Yunho said while looking at me. Wanting to take me here. I would have gotten the tickets if he told me when we'd go. I don't know how long it's been, I said while looking around the amusement park. All right, since we're here, since we're here, let's have a great time. Let's see, where's the ticket box? Oh, wait. I was about to look for the ticket box when Yunho held on to me. Huh? Ta-da! Yunho pulled out two tickets from his pocket. Oh, he already got them. Two all-day passes. Huh? Yunho, you already had the tickets? I remember the tickets being pretty pricey. Where did he get them? Yunho just grinned. Where did you get them? Was he working part-time at Banjul in order to raise up money to get the tickets to go to the amusement park? Is that what's been going on? It's a secret. So many secrets today. Now stop the boring interrogation and let's go in. Let's go ride the merry-go-round you like so much. Merry-go-round, merry-go-round. The tickets still bother me, but I do want to just let it go since Yunho is so happy. What should I do? Fuck. Hang on, hang on. Go to six. Um. Put it, put it here, I guess. I don't know. I'm going to try and keep track of my saves as best as I can. And I'll quick save too, just to be on the safe side. Um, I think it would advance the plot more if I said, where did you get the tickets in a way? But I also feel like that would be bad because it would probably piss them off. But I don't really want to do that. And then at the same, but at the same time, I also think this would advance the plot. Ah! I'm probably gonna choose the wrong thing, and then I'm gonna get a bad ending, and then I'm gonna have to try again. But since I'm saving so diligently, that might be okay. Maybe. Oh, cat hair on my screen. I just noticed that. Okay. I'm gonna ask him where he got the tickets. Wait, stop Yunho. I stopped Yunho who was grabbing my arms and trying to drag me away. Yes? Those tickets. Can't you tell me where you got them? Oh, I knew it. He looks mad. Oh, no. Yunho doesn't say anything. Does he not want to say? Yunho? I called Yunho, who wasn't replying. 
Uh, oh no. Do you not like that I bought the tickets? I was surprised at the slightly cold voice. What? No. I was just worried. <laughs> then it's fine. As I said no, Yunho smiled again. Then let's go, hurry! I stopped trying to ask as Yunho fiercely dragged me into the park, but I still kept thinking about the tickets. Who gave them to him? Where did he get the money to buy them? Did Yuri give them? I thought of a million guesses. We went into the amusement park. An amusement park. I don't even remember how long it's been since I last came. It's my second time here. Cheerful music and fancy buildings. The place where several characters come alive. Nothing has changed. I grabbed the map at the entrance and found where the merry-go-round is. It was still at the same location as when I last came. Yunho kept on grinning for some reason. I think the merry-go-round is this way. I'm so excited! Something from a fairy tale book is actually moving! How would it feel? I really want to ride the merry-go-round Master likes. Is there nothing else you want to ride? I see a lot of other rides that look fun in the park. I tried to plan a route while looking at the map, since it's important to use your time wisely in an amusement park. Let's go to the merry-go-round first. It's the one you like. I was a bit bothered that Yunho kept on talking about the merry-go-round. It's this way, right? You're usually interested in other things too if it's your first time. Did I excite him too much with my story? Anyways, I headed to the merry-go-round thinking he won't calm down until we ride it. Wow, so big! The picture in the book was really true! It's so big! It has to be this big for a lot of people to ride. It's big and has a lot of fancy decorations. I look at the merry-go-round of my memories and think for a moment. The little crybaby is gone, but the merry-go-round still stands. The little crybaby. Who could she be referring to? Hmm, the boy? That's the mysterious boy? Hmm. I see rusted parts here and there, but it's still beautiful. I was feeling nostalgic when I heard Yunho's voice from behind. Master, what are you doing? Over here! There's no line, so we can ride it right away! Yunho shouted towards me. Oops, I made him wait. I hurried. I got on the merry-go-round with Yunho. Yunho got on a white horse with a beautiful mane and I got on a small unicorn. The merry-go-round started to slowly move with a pretty melody. Wow, Master! I feel like the world is really spinning! Is it fun? Yes, and the wind tickles my face! Wow! <laughs> the place of Master's memories! The place of Master's memories! Aww! I can't... He's too cute! Though in this CG, he looks more like... Like he is a academy student rather than like a, a boy, if you know what I mean. Like he looks like he is older in the way that he's drawn here. I can't quite explain it, but that's kind of the that's kind of the image I'm getting. But if I get a bad ending, it'll be in this, and then I'll know exactly where what I need to do to fix it, so that's good. Because I passed the first chapter, so I don't think I did anything wrong in that. Oh, but wait, I didn't do everything completely correctly in the chapter before the cat one either, so uh, I'll just look at the guide to make sure, probably, if I do something wrong. <laughs> Yunho kept on muttering. Since it's the place of Master's memories, I have to like this place, too. Oh, this is getting dark quickly. Hmm? I didn't hear what he just said, so I asked. It's nothing. Yunho grinned and looked happy. Oh, this is making me uneasy again. Think of what you want to ride next. Anything I ride with you will be fun. Ah, so cool! I can't believe this is the place of your memories! I want to go everywhere that holds your memories. He keeps on talking about my memories. It'd be nicer if he could just enjoy the ride itself. This moment here with you is like a dream. Yunho makes everything be about me. I can't help but feel that's gotten more intense recently. But Yunho looks so happy right now. The melody stops and so does the merry-go-round. Wow, this is so fun! Master, what do you want to ride next? Hmm... I look around the park. A roller coaster goes through a loop. I told him before to think about it, and I asked if anything came to his mind. I want to ride whatever you want to ride. 
You got me the ticket, so I want to ride what you want. Huh? I... Yunho doesn't finish. If he got the tickets beforehand, wouldn't he have thought of what he wants to do in the amusement park? Yunho thinks for a while and lowers his head. Yunho is silent, and I take his hands. Should we get something to eat? Yes! Yunho smiles and nods. What should we get? Hmm, how about a hot dog? I remember the hot dog I ate when I last came here. Alright, you like hot dogs. Wait here, I'll go and get it. No, I'm getting it. Master, you just wait here. Oh, then take my wallet. I held out my wallet, but Yunho shook his head. No need, then I'll be back. Huh? But Yunho... Does he have the money? It's a little weird. The tickets and not taking my wallet? I sat on the park bench and thought for a moment. Yunho is very kind, and he always puts me above everything else. But... Yunho's kindness is a bit odd. Yeah! Yeah, thank you for realizing this, because now I've been noticing this for a bit too! Like, it's just... Oh, I can't... I, ha I thought of the stereotype last night, and I was like, Oh, that was it! Yandere! Yandere! There it is. Yandere. That's what it was. Oh! Duh! He's acting like one! He really is! And it's just freaking me out, because, like... No! No! I don't like them! They scare the fuck out of me! Like, Yuri from Future Diary? Fuck that! No thanks! She was terrifying! No! No, 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 I don't want that. Like, if anything, a tsundere would be way better. Like, I would take a fucking tsundere over a fucking yandere any day of the week. Like, fuck. I don't want this. <laughs> I'm terrified of this. We rode what you wanted to ride. It's my turn now. I came all this way to ride that. That's too scary. I hate rides that go up high. It only takes three seconds for it to fall down, and if you close your eyes, you barely feel it. Hmm? So let's go ride it. I'm still scared. It'll be fine. Trust me. Here, it's this way. The couple disappeared far away. That's how it normally is. How many times did I hear the word merry-go-round? I wish Yunho would be more honest about what he likes. <sighs> he is such a nice boy, but... How should I say this? It's like there's a wall I can't see. Master, I got the hot dog! Yunho smiled, holding hot dogs in both his hands. Oh, you're here. Yep, here, Master. Thanks. Yunho hands me a hot dog. Yunho hands me a hot dog. We sat on the bench and ate the hot dog together. The hot dog Yunho bought. It felt a bit weird. Where did he get the money? Did he get it from Yuri? The tickets, too. It really bothers me. But Yunho doesn't seem to want to say. I feel like he's hiding something from me. Let's not keep it in and just ask him. So when I ate about half of my hot dog, I asked Yunho. Yunho, how are you these days? Are you having fun? Hmm? At home or at the academy, I want to know if you're having fun. He didn't really hang out with the girls at the academy and disappeared to somewhere as soon as classes ended. Where does he go every day? I worried if something was happening. Of course I'm happy, since I get to be with Master like this. His smile told the truth. But why do I feel frustrated? I shoved the rest of the hot dog into my mouth and suddenly stood up. Alright, should we get going? There's a really scary roller coaster over there that makes you scream your lungs out. Let's go ride that! A roller coaster? Yeah, it's like a train that spins like this and hangs upside down like this, and of course it's really fast. I heard it's so scary and thrilling. Uh, I'm a little scared of what his reaction's gonna be. Upside down. Fast. Train. Yunho looked ambivalent. I grabbed his hand and dragged him. We can't miss the roller coaster at an amusement park. This might turn out terribly. Oh boy. Thank you for riding our speed train. Before heading out, watch your feet watch under your feet and check again if you have left any of your possessions. Thank you. Yunho didn't seem to hear the operator's cheerful voice. We came back to the bench. I sat him down on the bench since he was still dizzy from the ride. I felt bad to see his pale face. Yunho, are you okay? You should have told me if you were scared. I didn't know. You shouldn't have ridden it. Oh no. I'll- I'll be fine after a while. I'm sorry, Master. 
Why are you sorry? I'm sorry for making you ride it. No, you're not having fun because of me. I'm just troubling you. Don't say that. Ugh. Troubling me. I felt frustrated at his overly kind words. Don't worry about things like that. Let's just stay here until you feel better, alright? I talked to him in a kind voice. Ah. Uh. Ugh, that look. I don't like it. I really don't like it. Oh god, I feel like he's like some sort of fucking masochist. I can ride more. I'm fine now. Yunho looked at me with his pale face. You still look a bit queasy. No, I'm fine. Let's, let's go for more. Hmm? You have a lot of rides you want to try. What? I, I can ride more. Uh, if I feel frustrated at Yunho, that would make sense with how I'm going with things. And it would advance the story. Shit, 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 shit. 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 <laughs> I'm gonna put it here. <laughs> Fucking Christ, I don't know. I'll feel frustrated at him, because I feel like that will advance. It might wreck some things, though. <laughs> but you can't have ha hunky-dory positive vibes all the time in with this, or else you'll get a bad end, too, probably, I think. Ah, uh, but I'm so fucking scared as to how he's gonna respond to this. I don't... Ah, uh, I don't like this at all. Eat! I look at Yunho. He's pale as a ghost and still wants to try the rides. I wondered if he was just lying. I'm so sorry. Why are you apologizing? You seem mad because of me. Yunho lowered his head. I'm weak, so I worry you. I have to make Master happy. I'm sorry, Master. I'll be better next time. I'll be nicer. I'll try to ride the roller coaster really well next time. Yunho looked at me with his sorry eyes and I felt the frustration in me explode. Oh no. Oh no. Let's go home. M master You are mad. I'm not mad. I just wanted to go home and put him to bed. I didn't want to hear Yunho keep on apologizing. I carefully helped him walk and headed towards the bus station. He seemed to feel better after a bit of rest. Even on the way home, Yunho kept on apologizing in the bus, and I just told him to take care of himself first. When we got back home, he was still pale, so I took him to my room. I'm sorry, Master. Just get angry at me. If it makes you feel better, stop talking and just go to bed. You'll be better tomorrow, right? I hope he stops worshipping me like he did today. But it wasn't the right time to tell him this. I'm sorry, Master. I'll be a nicer boy. Stop and close your eyes. Okay. Yunho closed his eyes. Master, even when I close my eyes, you won't go anywhere, right? Hmm? I mean, you won't just disappear or something like that? You won't leave my side, right? What are you saying? You're sick because of me. I'm not going anywhere. I'll take care of you until you get better. Okay. Since you were by my side the whole day, it's not so bad being sick. I wish it'd be like this all the time. I'll get really mad if... I'll really get mad if you keep saying weird things like that. Sometimes Yunho says really weird things. Why does he act weirdly like this sometimes? Weren't you just really tired? You don't get much sleep to prepare breakfast every morning, and you don't come- And you come home late. It's fine. It's all for Master. Why do you come home late at night? Yunho turned his head as if he didn't want to tell me. Is it a secret he can't tell me? I did feel disappointed, but I gathered myself. I don't want to nag him when he's sick. Make time for yourself, too. Don't just always be at my back- Don't just always be at my beck and call. Master, you care for me. Thank you. I felt frustrated again at his response, but I couldn't trouble a sick person. I stroked his hair until he... I stroked his hair until he began to breathe regularly. A bit later, he fell asleep looking peaceful. Is... he sleeping? He was sleeping like an angel. I sat on my desk after making sure he fell asleep. I started to write in my diary, checking Yunho every now and again. The amusement park, Yunho's tickets, his happy face when he rode the merry-go-round, and the 
and the estrangement I felt. Ugh. I'm worried about Yun Ho. I felt sleepy. I couldn't fight it off and fell asleep on my desk. Oh no, is he gonna wake up in the middle of the night and say something fucking weird again? Master, you fell asleep here. You don't hate me because of today, do you? Do you? Master, I'll try harder. I'll try harder at everything for you. I'll always be a good boy. So, don't leave me. Okay, we successfully got to the next chapter. Okay. Uh, I'll just put this here. Obsession. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, God. I'm just going to leave it at that. <laughs> I, I, oh, this is getting scary and questionable and all kinds of weird. And, oh, boy. I feel like I just reached a bad ending. We'll see what happens, though. Oh, boy. Okay. Okay. I feel like I'm going the completely wrong way with this, but the... the the game seems to be telling me otherwise, but I don't know, and it's terrifying me, and just... Okay. Alright, I guess we'll find out if I die, or if Yunho... Something bad happens with Yunho, which it seems to be creeping in that direction. And, uh... Yeah! I think I chose, like, the worst character to start with. <laughs> I think I should have just gone with the order that it uh, recommended that you go in. I feel like, I feel like Lance is a good option after this. Yeah, I feel like Lance is a good option after this. Let's go with Lance after this, okay? Yeah, sounds good. Okay. Um, alright. I will see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.